I just wondered how it would have been, you know, growing up together, you know, to have families and stuff together. It would have been wonderful. Maybe Lou Jones often thinks about her older brother, Lachie, who went off to war when she was 15. He was just 17 years old, and he wanted to join the Army. And my parents let him. They sighed for him to go. Little did she know that that would be the last time she would ever see him after he was sent to Korea fighting in Ulsan. All five of Mamie Lou's brothers served in the military. Private First Class Lachi was the only one, though, who didn't make it home after serving. It was just the most devastating thing I ever seen from my mother and father. They got a, a letter stating, you know, that, that he was uh, missing in action, see. That's when we knew, you know, that, that something was wrong. It's been a mystery for 64 years, never knowing what really happened to their beloved brother. I've just never been able to understand, you know, how could someone just disappear right from the face of the earth. After years of wondering and heartache, their questions had finally been answered. Her brother had been found. It, this is the most wonderful news that I have heard in 70 years. My parents would have, Lord, they would have died to know this. They never believed up until they died that he was ever really dead. The family learned he was a prisoner of war for at least two years until he died on December 31st, 1953. His body was placed at the National Memorial Cemetery of the Pacific as an unidentified soldier. He gave for all of us. While it isn't the reunion Mamie Lou had hoped for over the last 64 years, she says she still can't wait to finally have him back home. I'm thankful and I'm glad. I love that boy.